Hi, I'm Juliet from Spoiled Rotten Beads and today I'm going to show you how to make these sparkly cathedral bangles. When you open your kit, you will find you have your bangle former, your wire, some sparkly preciosa fire polish beads and a charm and a little jump ring. What you need to do is take your wire and your bangle frame and grip the end of your wire against the bangle frame and wrap the rest of the wire around it heading towards the center of the bangle frame. And once you've got a little bit of wire onto the bangle frame like that, you'll find it's nice and secure. And what you can do is just trim off that little tail and tuck it in there and just wrap over the top of it to keep it nice and secure. And that's all there is to it, to attaching your wire. And now you're ready to add your beads. Once you've attached the end of your wire to your bangle frame, take one of the smaller fire polish beads and thread it onto the wire and bring that bead down to the frame. And then just position it in place with your finger and wrap tightly the wire around the frame once, one more time without any beads there. And then you just continue adding beads in the same way. So I'm going to take another of my smaller beads from my pack and thread that onto the end of the wire and then wrap it onto the bangle frame. I'm going to position the bead and wrap it once around without any beads and now I'm ready to add my next bead. And what I think I'm going to do is step up now to a larger beads. I'm taking one of my larger six millimeter beads and I'm going to thread that on and wrap that on as well. Now when you wrap, don't wrap too tightly because if you do, what you'll find you'll do is you'll start to pull the two sides of the bangle former um, together and you don't want to do that because you won't have room to put all your lovely beads on it if you do. So don't be too tight with it. And you just continue adding beads, keep the colours nice and random until you get to the other side and in a moment when I've got all my beads on, I'm going to show you how to finish these lovely bangles off. When you've attached all of your beads to the bangle, you just finish it off by tightly wrapping your wire around, nice and tight, neatly at the end there. And once you've filled in all the gap with wire, you can just trim off your little tail of wire and then use your chain nose pliers to squash that end of wire down so that it's tucked in nicely and um, doesn't um, catch on your clothing. When you've finished adding all of your beads onto the bangle, you can just finish it off by adding a charm onto the piece of one of the pieces of wire in between the beads there. So I've slipped on this jump ring here and then I'm going to pop my charm onto that jump ring. Okay, this one doesn't want to play ball. And then use my chain nose pliers just to close up that jump ring there. And there we go. I think the charm really finishes these bracelets off beautifully. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.